everyone on this computer fan flight test uh, video we're going to be testing these push pull configurations there's eight here um, in this dimension they're all 40 by 40 but the uh, the length of them varies from in each one you got an, an AVC Sani's 40 a Delta actually two Deltas uh, a Sunon another AVC an Invitec and a Nidec the push pull Sunon 0.4 Four nine amps, two point three ounces. Right up first is the Sonon at point four nine amps. Handling the voltage well. Both fans. I think one of the fans just died. Whoa. Jeez. That held on quite a while, and um, that was quite the death. A little tiny capacitor flew out, actually landed near my near the variac. Just a little baby one. It sounded like the bottom fan uh, shattered. Let me just pull this off here, and we'll have a look. Oh no, maybe maybe it didn't. It sounded like it did, but obviously it didn't. All right, well, on to the next one. The Delta 0 0.6 amp push pull. 1.8 ounces. All right, this is the Delta right at 0.68 amps. She's gone open circuit on both fans. Well, it can't be completely open circuit because the power is dropping when I turn it off. But, oh well, it's dead. The Nidic uh, 0.76 amp push pull. 2.6 ounces. Alright, this will be the Nidic rated at 0.76 amps.
one of them's not happy. Well, that about does it for that one. Invitec uh, 12 watt push pole. 2. Point, let's say 2.7 ounces. Alright, up next is the Invitec rated at 12 watts. This one's really burning up. Whoa. That one really burned up. Nice. Well, still no flight, but a good finish. AVC 1.14 amp push pole. 2.5 ounces. Next up is the AVC rated 1.14 amps. Wow, the heck? That was an odd way to go. Sani's 40, push pull, 1.1 amps. But three ounces. All right, next is the Sani's 40, also rated 1.1 amps. Bottom fan came back to life. And now the top fan. Although I can see something glowing in there. It actually sounds like they're both trying to start. But it's not very happy.
Very nice. The AVC push pull 1.5 amps. 3.2 ounces. The heaviest one yet. Alright, up next we got another AVC. This one rated at 1.5 amps. That was short lived. There's not even any smoke. That was awful. Delta forty by forty, one point eight two amps. So 2.8 ounces. Alright, last one up is the Delta. It's rated at 1.8 amps with a max current of 1.1 amps. And this is uh, probably going to be the best chance of one of these little uh, push-pull fans will have to fly. It's the most powerful ones I got. Sounds like it's got an RPM limiter. Yeah, it does. Well, see, it dropped the voltage, it actually speeds up. If I speed it up, it slows down. Alright. Well, I'm not going to destroy this one if it has a limiter. So, um, so all the fans I have destroyed, um, it, it wasn't in vain because I, all the ones that had ball bearings, I do pull all the ball bearings out of them because they are excellent little ball bearings and they run very well. So I do salvage something from these fans that do die. So, um, yeah. So, that pretty much does it for this uh, computer fan flight test series. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed watching this. I mean, we had one... 60 mil fan that could actually fly and that was quite amazing in itself the 3 amp delta so um yeah so slap that thumbs up if you uh, like this video uh, subscribe if you haven't and um, keep an eye out for whatever I think up next thanks for watching everyone